Hey everybody, hope you're having a great day. And today I received a portal. Uh, this is the second portal that I have received and looking forward to setting it up. Uh, the first portal is on the main level on the other side of the house. And down here, one of the challenges is it's not picking up and getting the kind of speeds that it should possibly get. And uh, you know, when you're going through walls and and you're walking a good distance as well through the other side of the house, there's a possibility you, you may need to get multiple devices and then you can mesh it together. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is put one down here and it should be able to connect with the one upstairs and then I should be able to then get great coverage both on my computer as well as my devices. Uh, the app works great, uh, there's so many features uh, within the portal that you can go through. Uh, and in the video, I explain about the two different types of spectrums. There's 2.4 and 5 gigahertz spectrum. And it helps when you've got a lot of devices um, in, in the surrounding areas, especially if you live in a city and you've got a lot of apartments using their Wi-Fi devices. Having this 5 gigahertz spectrum versus a 2.4 and breaking it up, that is pretty big and you got to have special um, licensing for the 5 gigahertz. So it's a very nice device. You've got uh, several ports on the back. You've got your USB, your WAN. Uh, there's some instructions here. Got it. Again, the app is great. Very easy to use. I'll show you as I connect the portal to and connect it to the app. Uh, you got the power supply and then you've got your Ethernet cable. Uh, so what's nice about this is I'm not going to need to hook up any wires. I'm just going to plug it in. It's going to find the device and then the two will speak and I'll get internet connection. Just to give you an idea down here now, let's go ahead and run a speed test. So it's a little bit over here versus behind me, but let's just see. So I'm doing the speed test now. And let's see, right now it it's not going very fast. Uh, it's been up and down. So let's see, the download speed, 23.2. Um, it got higher before, but again, I'll be really interested to see once uh, we connect this to the portal and then connecting it together. So let's see, so I got 23.2 and 10 up and 10.8 down. So let's go ahead, plug it in um, again. Uh, there is instructions uh, if you only are going to get one device and, and need one device, you, you know, the instructions are there. But the Portal uh, app makes it very easy. So let's go ahead and set it up, see what happens, and uh, looking forward to uh, seeing the results. Here we go. Okay, so I had to come back upstairs to the first Portal and connect it. So what I'm going to first do is power it on. And I've got to go from the LAN to the WAN setting on this one. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. Put this into the WAN. And then I'm going to click Next. And it says plug in and turn on to Portal 2 and then Done. And it's locating the second portal. And I am remaining close to the portal. And let's see what happens here. Portal already has an admin. You can reset and pair again. We'll try again. Portal found. All right, we are in business. Checking software. Hey, it's on. Sweet. We are in business. Let it do its thing. And then we should be able to go back downstairs and plug it in. And then I should be able to get internet connection downstairs. So let's give it here a minute and let it finish doing what it needs to do. By the way, one of the nice things about Portal is when you set this up, there's no registration. They don't need your information. Um, so we're going to give it some time. Let's see. It's going to, it says complete 11 minutes. Um, but we're, I guess we'll have to just give it some time to let it do its job. Uh, so what I'll do is come back. 
uh, after a few minutes and we'll check up on it and then we will set it up. So I will be back. Okay, it says portal upgraded. I'm gonna click continue. Continue adding my uh, new portal to my network. Continue. And let's see what happens. Now it's located in the second portal. Adding portal to your network. Cool. So it looks like it's working. And I look forward to just going downstairs and uh, seeing how it'll work down there. By the way, when it was doing the software update, it didn't take the full amount of time to update. Uh, so it got to around 60% or so, and then it said it was finished. Okay, all done. You can remove the Ethernet cable and move your portal to another room. All right, so let's go downstairs. Okay, so I'm downstairs. I'm going to go ahead and plug it in. Let's see what happens. I'm going to click home. And there you go. You can see now it's got both portal devices. Everything looks good. One guests are connected. Got eight devices. Um, one on the guest. Network we set up. All right, we are on. Okay, so now that we're set up, we're we'll go ahead and do the speed test, and let's see what we're getting now. Oh, look at that big difference. We'll go back into the initial room when I first started this video and see what kind of speeds. So big difference now. Wow, look at that. 83.7. Fantastic. We'll run it a second time to see, but these are very nice speeds I'm getting now. We'll run it one more time just to see the consistency. And it is, let's see what we get here this second time, very fast. 73.6, so still up there, um, but uh, you can see it's just off just a little bit second time around and the next test we'll do is back in the initial room so 73.6 and 12.1 let's go into the other room and see how we do okay so now's the big test I did a test behind the sofa just to see how the speeds were and my computer and what a big difference so I'm really excited as we did the initial test here it was in the 20s um, for the download speed and let's see so here we go let's see what it comes out at 67.4 that is a big jump for the download and let's see what the upload is and then what I'll do is I'll test it one more time just to be sure but uh, hey that's a big improvement so let's test again 68.8 that's pretty consistent uh, so again, meshing it has definitely made a big difference. And you could see, in my case, one portal was not enough. So 12.2 uh, upload. So there you go. Click on the link in the description, again, where you could read reviews. You can order one, you can order two portals. You might even need three, depending upon the size of your house. So this will give you an idea how to set it up. You've got to make sure to connect and hardwire to the first portal and then you're good to go and you can take the portal and put it in different rooms. So thanks so much for watching. Please let me know if you have any questions and portal, thank you for helping me have a faster internet connection. We'll see you on the next video. Have a great day.